Alright, gone courting and now local liquor store. Different. I knew you would like it. Look, baby, I thought we was gonna make some serious paper. I'm starting to get really bored of you. I just need the money. And I'm just a cheap fuck? A whore you don't even pay? No, I didn't say that. Carl, I say I'm in love with you and you act like I'm an idiot. I see the way you look at every window. I know you're kind, Carl. I am Whoa. serious. I will kill you if you ever mess around. I, I would rather have a Sanchez, not a freeway or a Wayfair or a four-wheeled vehicle. Please, sweetheart, I got in some real, real deep shit. Okay, maybe today we can it. You trying to put that on the G? Hold on a sec. Carl, you have to be totally ruthless. Come on, you gonna get on or what? Fine by me, silly cow. I'm looking for Sanchez. Uh, well, if I have to use the freeway, I will. Looks kind of like it. But I guess the uh, those enemies in the previous mission didn't like us using their pain spray, apparently. Right. Okay, I'm not going to bother trying to shoot them from a distance with the rifle. Not with my atrociously bad aim. Right. What vehicles do they have? Motorbikes and a quad bike. Yeah, two Sanchez's and a quad bike. Four weddings and a funeral. I think their bikes are bulletproof. Bloody hell. Nah. Their bikes are bulletproof, clearly. God, and I think they've got a lot more health than usual as well. Okay. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna buy some more uh, micro SMG ammo once this mission is over, by the way. Or I could buy it when I'm on my way back to Fern Ridge with. Twat, not cat. Right. Oh, really now? Yes, really, unfortunately. Oh well. How was it? Different. I knew it was Get in, C fucking J. I'm starting to get really bored of you. I just need the money. And I'm just How difficult is it, man? You don't even pay? No, I didn't say that. Ah, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. I will castrate you first, then I will make you eat that. Ah, right into the fucking wall. I wonder if I could, uh, make them mess up by doing that, maybe? Let me find a motorbike. Ah, Sanchez. No, I don't want that. Out of the way! Stupid whore. You know, I'm, I'm not going to take her with me. She's, she's just going to get killed. And this is a much quicker Sanchez, yeah. Okay, I can take these guys out myself. Don't need her stupid ass. How about no, bitch? Right. Okay, they don't have more health than usual. Right, just concentrate on these guys, okay? I've taken out all the gunners, that's fine. Yeah, only way to hurt them is by getting alongside them. 
Really? I'm doing a lot better than in the previous mission attempt, that's for sure. As CJ sometimes says, I've never known a cow that can talk. Right. If I have to uh, chase this guy all the way to the trailer park in Las Colinas, I will. Right, here comes the bridge jump. Well, not quite. Okay. We are good. Screw the pistol, I don't want it. Hopefully Cat doesn't die mysteriously if I go inside ammunition without regrouping with her. Okay. You guys fucking suck. That is a uh, pool cue. Right, game. Please don't glitch out. No, you're fine. No, I don't want the fucking tech night. I think I could be wrong, but I think this gun is a bit a bit better. Fucking alarm's still going off. Okay, Carl, let's get back to the hideout. And here we go. Okay, look, but we gotta talk about something. What? What do I have to say to you? You're a great girl and all, but you gotta calm down. I know some cold blooded cats who wouldn't act like you. Carl, you get given a lie on What's that? My apologies. Whatever. Carl, you have much to learn about the female heart. Come and see me again when you think you understand it. Goodbye. Right. Hope they can see in the dark during this mission. I still go to that. Like a woman reborn. Cool. Maybe you won't go berserk, huh? <laughs> what was that? Oh, well that's a relief to hear. Perhaps this time no cow and motherfuckers will get in our way. Amen to that. Come on, try. What's wrong? Nothing, I just hate men. Well, give me a break. Here's your break. Your break is you're not on my barbecue being eaten. Well, that's Oh, fuck it. Perhaps this time no Remington motherfuckers will get in our way. Now try to stay on the bike this time. Maybe we should have bought armor as well. I hope you drive better this time around. You ever driven a quad? It ain't easy. Especially when you got a screaming bitch on the back shooting past your ear. I like it when you angry at me, girl. I will try to anger you more often. Now that I'm looking forward to. Be careful what you wish for. So don't take any shit. Oh, I lost my spa shotgun. Snap. I better take that back. 
Right, I bet they've got more powerful guns than them. Who am I shooting at? Uh, oh, fucking hell! Give up. You're surrounded. Another one of Sweet's toys. Just use the shotty. It's fine. Or let her do the fucking work for once. Mm, new police bikes. I wonder what this bike's called. Oh, police wayfarer. Cool. Yeah, the game is being a slow bastard right now. Doink. Use your heed. Don't take speed. That's what they taught us at school. True story. Right, what weapons have these guys got? Hopefully nothing too horrible. Okay. about you either. That's just it. How little you know. Don't talk. Let us enjoy the peace and quiet. Come on, Carl, move it! Already on. There you go. Thanks. One day, Carl Johnson. What do you think I've been doing for the past uh, few minutes? Right. I'll wait for the phone call from Caesar, which uh, unlocks Woozy Moot. And then I'll need to find uh, some kind of fast car. Oh, here we go again. Does it still leave uh, Grove Street? Yeah. I got the lowdown on Smoke's Yay, where it is every Monday and Friday the cash leaves Los Santos for San Fierro. Then every Wednesday and Saturday, a courier takes the Yay back to Big Smoke. Okay, I keep an eye out for him. See if I can't spoil their little port. All right, man. Hmm. Yeah. The subtitles missed out Friday and Saturday. Interesting. Well, uh, I think so far I've only uh, attacked, uh, you know, the enemies Re during these, uh, excuse me, events once in any of my San Andreas playthroughs here, yeah, the Ye Courier during. Uh, my top down camera playthrough. Let me get the Remington. So I highly doubt I'll be able to use a motorbike. So I'm pretty sure you can't in the vanilla game anyway. Oh god. Right. What cars have they got this time? No, they're they're not the same. Because yeah, Woozy normally drives something else. Can't remember what though. Right, come on, pick up the pace, buddy. Bloody hell, they're shooting on ahead. Oh fucking hell! I don't think those barrels are meant to be there. Oh dear, someone's having an early bath. Suits me. Oh god. 
No, they're definitely not meant to be there, those barrels. Oh look, somebody must have fished them out of the water. With some strong as fuck fishing rod. Must have been as strong as uh, Zero's underwear in the opening cutscene of Supply Lines. Yeah, also known as the cutscene in which uh, Zero almost gets chopped in half. Right, that must be some kind of modified clover. Fucking hell. Even if I take the shortcut coming up, I'm probably still gonna lose. But I'm pretty sure that Walton that you saw back there is scripted, yeah, part of this mission. Take advantage of the fact that the checkpoints have big hitboxes. Oh good, finally I'm first. Ah! Right, keep it up. Giant steps are what you take walking on the moon. Aye, fuck you! Shitbag von Dick Splash. Right, get out of the way, camper van. Drive! No, 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 no! Now is not the time to do shitty things like that. And they're catching up again. Glorious. Okay, no shortcut for me to take that time. Uh oh, uh oh. Come on, straighten up. Ah, nice. Well played, sir. Right, sadly, I can't reload the autosave, otherwise it'll glitch out. Ooh, yeah. Are the windows uh, normally tinted on that car during the cutscene? Yeah, even though I got an autosave, I shouldn't reload it, otherwise... Uh, I'll encounter some nasty glitches. He's got a nice quick ZR now. Quicker than a Remington. Alright. Uh, I'll go on then. Be careful about it. Yeah, it's a shame that I'm not going to be able to reload the autosave because uh, if I f lose the race I won't be teleported back to the starting line. No, I'll have to... Uh, just let him pass. I'll have to uh, drive all the way back. Right, quick, quick, quick. Go, 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 go. Right, yeah, do go right. Yeah, right indeed. Right, more fucking bottles. I don't know if those barrels are always there in this mod, or if it's uh, just in this uh, mission and the previous one. Is it just me, or is the race course slightly different this time around? I'm not sure. I'm really, really not sure. By the way, given that uh, Paramedic was unchanged, I have a feeling Vigilante and Firefighter and all that will be unchanged as well in this mod. So this might not be a 100% completion playthrough, but I will still collect all the new collectibles. And I might, just might, try the new stunt jumps as well. Yeah, I have never completed all the stunt jumps in any of my San Andreas playthroughs. And that's because they're not actually required from 100% completion. I mean, off camera I've completed them all, but just uh, not for YouTube. No.
again hungry neck crack well this is uh, going a lot better compared to woozy moot hell to the yeah by the way on my way back to uh, the truth for the next mission I'll grab some more armor from RS Hall damn straight I will Okay, not far now. Ah, way too easy. Yeah. Good job. That was a relief compared to the uh, body harvest. Okay, not too far from... Yep, yeah, Fern Ridge. Let's save there. I'll take the phone call from the truth first. And then I'll save. Your own personal Jesus. Yep, that's the song that plays during the ending cutscene of Farewell My Love. Depeche Mode. Rest in peace, Andy Fletcher. Oh! Out quickly, come on. I don't fancy losing all those guns. What's that? Hey, Carl, dude. Now I got the little mom out you're after. Uh, save again. And by the time I get to the true swarm, it'll be nice and light. Right, I'll speed it up until I'm at the true swarm, but on the way I'll get some more armor. <laughs> Unlucky, mate. Ah, the triumphant arrival. Here we go, folks. Uh, oh, bloody hell. Yeah, that time limit. Okay. If I'd known the time limit was going to be that tight, I would have uh, grabbed some more Molotovs from uh, Los Santos. Well, I do have a few satchels left in my inventory, so uh, I might end up using them. Yeah, I think I will actually. Plant them in between. Yeah. Yeah, not bad. Right. Oh, come on. I, I know you can also use a combine harvester. And a lawnmower to take them out. I've still got to shoot the fucking chopper down as, as well. It's not going to be easy to shoot it down because uh, the there's no uh, cross here this time around. Go. Run. Pfft, I'm not going to shoot it down in well, what's going to be less than 10 seconds by the time I get there. Oh, come on. Come on. I can't hit it. Oh! That is so irritating. Jeez, you've got to be shitting me. Oh, and I'm out of satchels as well. 
Well, hey, at least I'm here. I don't have to, uh, you know, go all the way back. I don't have to reload my save at Fernridge and then drive all the way back here. Right, let's have another go. Hit them with a quick uh, burst of flame and then run to the next set of fields, okay? No! Yeah, sure, try burning them with a fucking camera. Best strategy ever. No, not really. You know, it might be worth uh, starting on the fields that are further away, you know, furthest away, and then just working your way back towards the truth. If I have to get Molotovs or even grenades, I have to, I will. Yeah. Right. Ah, oh, Mr. Patch of Weed. Yeah, just here. That's fine. Okay, that was a bit quicker than last time, though. Right, you police chopper. Got it. Come on, hit the ground and blow up. Yes, well done. Good shooting. Don't need Molotovs or grenades after all. Let's move, fellas. Nice job. Looks a bit shinier than usual. You better drive. I haven't driven in 15 years. You was doing all right? Yeah. Then the fear hit me. Now I'm rolling a number to calm the waves. Shit! I better call Caesar. Hey Caesar, no time to talk, man. I'm on my way to San Fierro, okay? I'll meet you and Kendall at that garage I wanted the races. I'll let y'all later. And turn right at the top to find the tunnel. Hey, this thing go any faster? Man, we got three tons of grass on board. The engine block is held together with a macrame hammock and it's running on 15 year old cooking oil. Shit, can you shoot? Shoot, I'm a hippie. The only thing I've shot is acid. I heard about this dude snorted it once. Thought his nose was a kangaroo and the moon was a dog. Woo! I think the only shooting that the truth does is, uh, Shooting the shit. Jesus, we screwed. When'd you get this? 1967. How you get around if you don't drop? I have an astral goat called Herbie. She's faster than most, but getting old. Yeah, whatever, man. You talking shit? I'm gonna get the uh, put it out, motherfucker. I'm warning you. Conversation now. What's with all aluminum for you, Nope. Man? Protection from mind control, dude. Mind control. Induction of images, sound or emotion using microwave radiation. Do you know how many government satellites are watching any citizen at any moment? No. 23. Do you know how many religious relics are kept at the Pentagon? No, I don't. 23. You see a pattern emerging here, man? Man, I'm seeing patterns all over the place. Get that smoke out my face. There she is, brother. San Fierro, the city of psychedelic wonders. Man, I can't believe I ain't been here before. There ain't a better place to escape the man, man. Okay, Mr. San Fierro, where's the spot at? It's in Doherty, on the east side of Fierro, between Garcia and Easter Basin. And the reason I stopped by that camera was because I wasn't sure if I had a camera in my, in my inventory or not. Then I remembered I do. Hello? A That's you. Cocktail with some Nepalese munga munga. Put that thing out. What's that? Is that a cheetah? Yeah. Are you sure? Bugger off. 
And secondly, I never made love to my... This is the place. Whoa, Jesus, dude. Looks like you've been fed a bummer. Yeah, I think it's a cheetah, but I'm not 100% sure. Oh, yeah, I thought it looked a bit different, yeah. Notice how that's uh, blue, not uh, red on the radar. I guess it just represents... Uh, yeah, it just uh, represents the colour of uh, the house icon in the game. Cool. Alright. I think I'll do... Uh, are you going to sun? I mean, wear flowers in your hair, sorry. And then I'll come off. Come on, man. There's these two guys I know. Used to work oh. on marine engines. Until the mob bought their business over in Vice. Now they try and make ends meet by taking any old job. They're a little bit dull by their habit. But the smoke don't get in the way of their skills with an engine. We'll pick up Jethro first. Last I heard, he was working at a garage over in East Basin. So it's a damaged... Landstalker, not an emperor this time around. Hey man, how you meet these dudes anyway? Can you repair it? Apparently. Apparently. You know how it is, man. Feel the tents, crazy ass music. It's got shitty handling as well. Vodka, polar bears. Polar bears. Yeah, go figure. But they were funny guys, man. Great sense of humor. Haha. <laughs> how come the garage door won't close? I have no clue. Right, I'll take the usual shortcut past this big ass building right here. Aye, without tipping us upside bloody down, of course. And we you shut it, though. Do we get chased in this mission? Hopefully not. Oh shit. Hey, Jethro. So, you know, like, what's the deal, dudes? I'm opening the garage and door to by the waste ground. You know, car mods, low riders, all that shit. You down? Do polar bears shit in the woods? No, but they've been known to shit in the liquor tent, if I remember it right. Yeah, that was like so far gone. A shiny red cross on the radar as well. So normally it's like a uh, solid red, but now it's got uh, a bit of a shine to it. Glossy, I suppose. Oh God. <laughs> what we here for anyway? Nothing. Come on, dude. What's all that about? You know yeah, what is all that about? Do you know what a subdermal neurophone is? A what? Exactly. Sometimes it's best to stay in the dark, kid. Quack. What shit, I'd rather not. Dude, Dwayne, man, how's the hot dog business? Totally shit. I like the new uh, police station icon as well. I think I'll wrap this recording session up by um, increasing my muscle a wee bit further. And then speaking to Katie. And then I'll come off. Listen to Jethro. Now, what if I told you we never went to the moon? JFK lives in Scotland with Janis Joplin, and the only reason we've been in a Cold War for the last 45 years was because snake-headed aliens run the oil business. I think you popped another micro guy. Good. Keep it that way. Pee off. Oh yeah, and get my chainsaw back. That's right. I think it's uh. Ooh, I think it's uh. Yeah, right. Yeah, I think it's uh, amongst uh, one of those uh, derelict buildings at the construction site. Leave me alone, Berkeley. This is stalking. Carl, zero, 
Zero, Carl. Sup? Carl here is opening a garage around the corner. Ooh. I told him you're the man to speak to when it comes to electronics. <laughs> Actually, I'm the only man to speak to. <laughs> Grade A tip top genius. That's me. You should drop by the shop sometime. See some of my shit, bro. I'll do that. One of the the nine boys, triads and mafia have tags as well. A week of hard work. Right ye ho. Right, I need to get a smart car. As an a very, very nice car. Yes, a sexy car. Otherwise, uh, Katie won't want anything to do with me. Right, gym time. One last time. And then I shouldn't have to go there ever a bloody again. And Katie's at the Avispa Country Club. I wonder what random events will take place in San Fierro. Yeah, very curious. Ooh, another new outfit. Yeah, what? Sorry, Carl, are you busy? Yes, bugger off. Oh. <laughs> Rising up straight to the top. Hope it's not too heavy. That's fine. See you at the end. And I should have more than enough muscle. Yeah, that is more than enough muscle in order to date Katie and Millie in LV. Yeah, I might need more sex appeal though, but it might be just enough. We're about to find out, folks. Is she still... Hmm. Oh. It looks like she's... Uh... Oh. Yeah. I think that a uh, comet is going to prevent her from uh, ever spawning. Yeah, because normally she spawns uh, just around about here someplace. So I'm sure she does. Oh dear. I'll come back. And this, see what happens. I suspect that comet is just gonna, you know, spawn where it was before I moved it. Or is this not gonna spawn at all? Mm. Right. I didn't increase my muscle for nothing. No, no, no. Because I still need high enough muscle in order to in order to date uh, Millie. So it's fine. I wonder. Can I get inside the driving school? So I wonder if uh, Michelle will be there. Yeah, Michelle's there, but Katie clearly is not. Yeah, looks like uh, that's intentional. <laughs> One more try. Uh, I like to think I'm not looking in the wrong place, but I'm pretty sure I'm not. Pretty sure I am looking in the right place. Hmm. Unless she's up here. No, normally she's on. She's in the northeast corner. Of a Vespa Country Club. Hmm. Forget it. I think it's time to call it a night. 
I will see you in the next recording session. Hope you enjoyed. I sure did. Thanks for watching. Stay solid. And don't let just business or tanker commander. And what else did I have trouble with in this recording session? Local liquor store, I guess. Bite. Until next time, take care. And good night, San Andreas. Bugger off, Caesar. Hey, go away. Anyway, I'm able to squeeze one more mission into part six of this playthrough. And I'm going to use the brand new cheetah to get to the hotel. Right, I suspect uh, this time around we'll have an extremely tight time limit. So, uh, don't hang about. That's fine. I wasn't sure if I um, missed anything new in the subtitle. Right. Come on, it's green. Get round the corner. Easy peasy. You don't need this no more. No, he does not. Will it still be a uh, blue merit? Say what? Park this car here, so the other guys can park it. Okay, it is indeed still a blue merit, if you would call it blue. Okay, I still have my camera, so I can look out for it. Must be it. It is indeed. Right. Just want to make sure I'm going the right way. Yeah. Go straight to the end of this road and turn left at the bottom of uh, Lombard Street. I know in this game it's called Windy, 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 Windy Street or Something like that. I'm just going to call it Lombard Street for two reasons. One, that's what it's based on in real life. And uh, two, Lombard Street is much easier to say. Fuck, I damaged it. But, um, does it not get repaired once you plant the drugs? I think it does. It better get repaired. It does, that's fine. Okay, speed on. That's an awfully tight time limit. A minute 30. I don't think I'm going to do it, folks. Bloody hell. Something's telling me I'm not going to do it. Oh, clutch! <laughs> Jeez, 
I don't know what, um, how do I say it? What was the bigger clutch moment, that, or what happens during PCJ Purgatory in my uh, Titan Vice playthrough? Well, my reaction this time around was much calmer compared to uh, what happened in Titan Vice. Do you know who you're fucking with here? I'll have your badge, you moron. Shut up! Find anything back there? Found anything? He's got half a Mexico in here. Must be two tons of Mary here. What? But but I've never seen. How could it be? Hell of a defense you got there, buddy. Yeah, I'm thinking about doing um, deconstruction as well, given how uh, short and easy 555 wee tip was. Come on, get in the car. Okay, for some reason it wouldn't let me get in the car. I'm going to try it now. Okay. Hashtag weird ass shit. Anyway, good job. I... Uh, Genuinely thought I was gonna fail. Five, five, five. We tip by running out of time. Good job, that man. Right, so let's get a motorbike from her. <coughs> Hashtag strong as hell brakes. Stick your low rise jeans up your arse. Crack kills. I was gonna say, hey, butt crack, get a belt. I think you'll find she already has a belt on. Okay. Because why the hell not? I'm considering getting some grenades from uh, ammunition. I think I do have an RPG with uh, seven rockets in it. I'm going to let this cutscene play out in case uh, there's anything new. Okay, what the hell. Okay. Hello. This could help. It's not as heavy as a bulldozer, but uh, it's nice and fast. Uh, what if I just uh, take out these guys? Oh, so the clock appears um, when you attack the construction workers, not the portables, okay. Oh, another outfit. And there's my chainsaw. Mind the bottles, Mr. Bean. And crunch. Hello? Holy crap, I didn't see nothing. Where does he go? Because uh, normally he goes into uh, a mobile toilet. Um. Oh, in the building. Okay. Right, hold on. Let me uh, take out the guy who's behind the wheel of that other dozer. Without getting turned into a pavement pizza. He's dead. Someone's got a shotgun. I saw that. Yeah, there he is. That hard hat ain't gonna save you now. Oh, he's got one too. One one was a racehorse. Two two was one two. Jerry was a race car driver. Yeah, they keep respawning. The shotgun guys. Right. Jesus. Right, okay. Blow these fuckers up. <laughs> right, I haven't got an extinguisher. So I'm gonna have to wait for um 
the flames to go out before I can uh, get that toilet out of there. Come on. Let me blow that fucker up as well. Hmm. Told you I could do it. Ha 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 ha. Who needs the shotgun ammo? Also, me picks it up anyway. No, I wanted the money. Right, the flames are out. Let's grab another bulldozer if I can find one. Right, he's not got a shotgun. That's fine. I might take him out anyway, though. Oh, I saw that Reefa tag up there. Right, how am I gonna, gonna get this fucker out of here? Uh, oh, is the yeah the bull the bulldozer is gonna fit. That's fine. Right, and there are three portable toilets. Bloody hell! <laughs> Fuck. I wonder if I could. Uh, just a sec. Oh no. I forgot there's an invisible time limit. Yeah, there is actually an invisible time limit at this point in the mission. It's stuck against those feckin' shelves. Right. right just... Get out! Bloody thing. <laughs> I am so gonna run out of time. I've got to... If I, if I use the bulldozer, it's just gonna get... Yep. If I use the bulldozer, it's just gonna get blown up by the fire. Fine, here we go again, folks. Ugh, oh, fuck's sake. Ah! Fuck. is an invisible time limit when you have to uh, body the foreman. I totally forgot about that. Okay. Right. See him again. Take out the other guy in the bulldozer. If I can. He's dead. Uh -oh. Nice. No, he's not got a shotgun. He has another weapon that begins with sh shovel. Boom. Right, I've used the rocket launcher to blast it out the door. Thank god they have very little health. No, get it out the door, come on. Okay, that's not bad. Just uh, watch the flames. You can jump through the flames to avoid getting set on fire. Right, let me get a dozer. Okay. Right, uh, hurry up flames, come on. I've got to get the bulldozer in there. Well, hopefully if I drive away and come back, the flames will have gone.
Yeah, given how long it took for the uh, mission to fail last time, I think you have a rather generous time limit. Okay, we're good to go. Don't touch it. God. Come on, get in there. Please try not to get stuck. Please don't get stuck! Ah! Cannot push it with my body or something. Or this. No. Bollocking hell, it's stuck. Get in it! Come on, CJ! What are you playing at, man? No! I can't get that out. No, nope. it's impossible. Right, I've got a new strategy. Use that car to push it out instead. As in, this car. Yeah, fuck the bulldozer. I'm not going to use it. Well, I will use the bulldozer to take out the portables, but I'll use that car to get the toilet. Outside. Right, third time's the charm. Because the bulldozer is clearly too big to get in there. Well, you can get in there, but uh, you can't get back out again. Well, you probably can with a bit of luck. Ah! Okay. I'm okay. Ooh, a tech nine. Okay, hopefully I remember that's there. Right. First, let me take out you. Ah, there's the shotgun twat. Right. F oof, hold on. Construction site. It's more like a fucking bomb site. Right. Grab the car. Nice and fast now. Good, it's still there. I really hope this works. Can't wait to see the end of this mission. Hasn't the successful end. Yeah, that guy's fucking about. Just leave him. Let him be silly. Good. Right. Uh, right, hold on. I've still got to use the RPG to knock it outside, you know, towards the door. And it's not going so well, unfortunately. That'll do, to be honest with you. I saw that guy. We get the money, I'm against the clock. Right, I'll drive away make, to make the flames go away. Right, fingers crossed, that's the words I'm getting. <laughs> I'm getting sick of this. <laughs> right, that's right. Reach for the sky, motherfucker. Ah! Is it gonna work though? Kind of? There we go. Why didn't I think of this sooner? Thinking about getting a dozer. Well, be quick about it. I still got to bury him as well with the cement truck. Go. Oh, fuck's sake. You know, if I knew. If I, if, if I could see the time limit, this would be a lot easier. I'm still gonna fail, aren't I? Oh, God, no! yeah, so much for a generous time limit, I'm not gonna do it.
right. This time. This time. The car is going a bit closer. There. And you know what? Hmm. And he's getting taken out first as well. As in before I triggered the toilet part. I'll take out that one last. Then I can get the car. Oh no, wait, I've still got to knock the toilet. Outside, that's right. I'll get that one last then. Car has gone. Bugger. Hold on a sec, I'm being I'm being harassed by somebody. Not anymore, he's dead. Right, okay. That's kinda what I wanted. I'm on fire, bloody hell. Getting a brand new ZR three hundred and fifty. Lost the wheel, bloody hell! Just a sec. I think this is the mission of the playthrough so far. Such a tight time limit, and it's in a very, very awkward place too. I'm gonna end up pushing it back into the fucking building if I'm not careful. Oh my own shit. I can't do it. I can't do it. I know that's very defeatist, but I can already tell that I'm not gonna do it. Smash it up with the bulldozer to take out that one. Ah, uh, no, 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 no! Ah! Uh, come on, CJ. Oh, fucking hell! Start again. Take out the bottles first. I was under the impression that the bottles uh, spawned. Uh, he's still not dead. No. I thought those bottles spawned uh, once the toilet section began, you know. Ow. Oh, 
Come on, forklift. No, seriously, come on, forklift. Forklift, fuck. Right, I really hope those barrels haven't respawned. Yeah, you. Who else? Another shotgun twat. Oh god, yes. Ah, oh, now it is no. Right, get out the door. Out the door, go on. Get out. Piece of crap. Pun definitely intended. You are fucking me off. Right, come on. Come on. Other side. Please don't set that on fire, as in the dozer. Oh, damn it! Why does this have to be such a fucking massive ass vehicle? Hmm? Right, come on. Careful. Shotgun guy. Right, hopefully this is the successful attempt. Ah, frustrating, isn't it? <laughs> get in there. As they say in golf, get in the hole. Right, come on. Time waits for no one. There we go, folks. <laughs> At last. Don't ask me why I struggled so much with that mission. Even I don't know. Anyway, folks, that wraps up this extra recording session. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Stay solid and don't let deconstruction bite. Until next time, take care and good night, San Andreas. Actually, before I come off, let me have a look to see what that brand new outfit is. And I get the chainsaw too. Yeah, the outfit was there. I'll get the chainsaw first. Okay. Down. Oh! <laughs> Fog gonna make you sorry. One, two, buckle fog shoe, three, four, cut up a whore. Stu? Yes? Remake of your Manhunt playthrough? When? Who knows what the future...